this is a video by inetsecurity.in and uh, and I am Joshua Prince and in this lecture we are going to see about information gathering and the tool that we are going to use is Zenmap. So I am going to give you a basic introduction about Zenmap. Zenmap is the official Nmap security scanner in the form of graphical user interface and it is a multiple multi-platform uh, tool we can use it on Linux, Windows, Mac or OS and also any form of uh, BSD versions. It is a free and open source application. The aim of Zenmap is to make Nmap easy for beginners to use while providing advanced features for experienced Nmap users. So uh, as we discussed before in the previous session, uh, we have used Nmap which consists of command line, uh, command line uh, queries all we have to do is to type commands so that we so that to get information about uh, the network or the domain or anything else so here we are going to use a graphical user interface tool which can makes it easy to uh, execute commands and uh, gathering details is very easy in this session so uh, the frequently used scans can be saved as profiles to make them easy to run repeatedly a command creator allows interac interactive creations of nmap command lines. This is the very important thing we are going to see here. Because uh, in the uh, nmap session, all we have to do is to type queries and we need to create the command. Uh, we need to set up the command with uh, all the possible options and uh, the specific details we need to we need to know and if you are going to save it into some other file we need to uh, put some uh, specific options to convert the file to a to an output here we don't need to do anything even if you want to do uh, any uh, command specifically you can add it of your own so this command creator allows interactive creation of nmap command line scan results can be saved and viewed later and all the saved scan results can be compared with one another to see how they differ so uh, here I'm going to give you the disclaimer we do not allow you to do any misbehavior thing do not misuse the information that is used for learning purpose and we are not really responsible for your activities of stupidness and wrong intention this is only for educational purpose so next we'll go on uh, to the practical sessions so I'm going to open the <coughs> Zen map so this is how the tool will be and uh, here you will be seeing the space for uh, the specifying the target and the profile and here you can see a list of uh, profiles some of them are intent scan intent scan plus UDP with all uh, TCP ports with no ping only ping scans quick scans and uh, you can also have a slow comprehensive scans so here is the space where we are going to get all the information about uh, the thing we are going to set it up, set up as, a, as the target and uh, so you can uh, clearly see I'm going to use my website as my target so here I'm using my own domain <coughs> inetsecurity.ind.in and I'm going to use the profile intent scan and here you can see the automatic automated uh, command creator so here it creates the command nmap hyphen capital T4 hyphen a hyphen v followed by the host name so we don't need to type any command even if you want to type all you can do is you can uh, simply edit the command whatever you want to do and I'm going to click the scan button and we have to uh, sit for a second so that it can uh, make a clear scan about the domain in the previous uh, examples using nmap we have uh, gather information about the open ports inside the network so that it means uh, we can get uh, details about uh, the services and the hosts that are up inside the LAN network here we are going to do here we are going to perform 
uh, a different kind of search with a server name or else the domain name so I think this scan has been completed so I'm going to the top here you can see the domain name and the IP address of the server and also here we can see there are thousands of ports and from that thousands of ports we have uh, more than 10 ports which are open and uh, we can do anything we want to do and uh, here I would like to tell you something please do not do any uh, misbehavioral activities here because we are having a firewall and also we are uh, having a top security for our website and now I have disabled all the things just for uh, showing you the way it can be done so we don't want you to do or perform any kinds of hack to our server which makes you to sit behind bars so here <coughs> we can gather details like uh, the trace route and the information about the port specifically here you can see the port and the state of the port and the service that is running uh, using the port number and the version the present version so in this port 421 the state is open and the service that is using the port 21 is FTP and the version we are using is pure FTPD and you can get all the informations like the signature algorithm and MD5 hashes and everything so likewise you can get all the details very clearly so that it will make you uh, easy for to do to perform different kinds of attacks later and I would like to show you one more thing we are having an uh, some firewall things which we want you to know so that uh, we are we just want to make sure that you should not do or perform any kinds of hack to our server so this is the trace route and it starts from the IP address the local host and to the gateway and finally to the <coughs> IP address of the server and now I'm going to show you the service services that are using in my server so FTP, HTTP, IMAP, IMAP, S yes, and POP3, POP3, S, yes, SMTP, SNMP, SSH and SSL and TCP wrap so here are the ports and hosts and states and services uh, this is a very uh, easy way to get all the informations specifically on the post ports and hosts here there are two ports are closed one is 161 and another one is 22 SSH and SNMP are closed and the topology you can see it in the fish eye so it starts from the local host and then it moves to the router address or the gateway address and travels through all the different kinds of servers finally my request has reached the server and also uh, we have gathered some more details this denotes uh, the server is using some kind of Linux based systems and the host name is inetsecurity.ind.in and the server name and the Linux operating systems name and version this accuracy it denotes um, the uh, very closest guess of the operating system and finally here you can see the command that we have used so whenever you want to go to the details or whenever you're going, uh, you want to cross check the scanned records you can uh, open the software and you can get the information whenever you want and this is how we can use the Zen map for gathering information about the website thank you